Hmm. It doesn't look like anything that we would want. So I'm gonna change it again. So if you were wondering why we are changing and changing the town and that's because we want to have something that looks good color the whole thing faster now let's erase everything here and let's start from scratch okay Okay, checking OBS, which is running good. So if XP adds support for Mac, that would be awesome. Okay, anyway. So now let's... Hey, what's up now, eh? How's your day coming along? Okay, so for a metal tile, let's do some trial and error. Okay, so this looks weird. Are you bored? If you are bored, you could always chit chat.
And okay, I see. So, what is it that you really enjoy doing? Is it because it's tough to do what you enjoy? I'm not sure if I'm the right person to inspire you, but okay, I definitely understand where you are coming from. Okay, so I am making a road light to the platformer okay, for Windows, Mac and Linux. So basically you will find elements of road, road light games. Okay, for example the stages are all randomly generated and death is permanent. So it is kind of a challenging game. Okay, so if you go to desra.com okay, it, it should be somewhat on the main page okay, The game's name is Stars With three S's at the back of the word Star So currently there are four four playable characters and two worlds that you can challenge. So right now I am preparing for the third world which is the meta world. Okay, but as you can see I still need more experience in drawing meta tiles. Okay, as currently I'm just redoing everything until I get it right. Hey sure, thanks for dropping by. Hey, I hope to see you again. As it was really great chatting with you.
Oh, okay. So I got the move. Okay, so I'm trying something different over here. So this time, instead of random patterns, we are going to have this thing straight lines. So starting from here Okay, we need to decrease the Saturation of the color Hey, what's up Super Gordon? How's your day coming along? Okay, so right now we are redoing our pixel art So as you can see a lot of it is Changing the shade of the pixel over and over again so that we get what we want. Okay, so this is slightly too dark for what we need, so I'm going to change it. Okay, it is still too dark, so I'm going to change it again.
Hmm. Okay. So the center part needs to be thicker. Okay, so wow, okay, just imagine multiple tiles of this design line up next to each other. So it looks, maybe it looks like a metal tile than before, but it looks kind of plain. So we are going to okay, edit it again. Huh. Okay, so if I do this, the bottom will look like this oh, that looks interesting okay let's try okay what if we do this nope okay so let's stick with this okay for the bottom Okay, maybe we could remove the bottom edge. Okay, so what we're gonna do is remove this and this. Oops. For our main color, let's hide it. Okay, let me just turn off the okay. So currently it looks something like this. Okay, so this is our first version. Hmm. Let's see if Okay, what if we do something like this? Three, four. Nope. Doesn't look like what we would want.
Okay, so we are making some progress even if it is a little small step forward. Okay, so now we are going to add some pattern to this. So Over here, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And to indicate that there is shadow behind the Okay, behind the pattern right in the middle, we will use this to indicate the shadow or we could also make it wider so at least it looks more visible Okay, so now it looks much better. Okay, as now it has some shadow to it. Which gives it a kind of texture feeling. And to top it off, here we will brighten this area up to show that it is exposed to the light source from the top. Okay, so that means for this, we need to put this Okay, 
Hmm. Okay. So as you can see, it looks totally different from the brick and the ice tiles. Okay, what if we remove this? Very change how it looks. 